Hi, uh, my name is Richa Tyagi. I wanted to share my experience from infertility to having a child now. I started my journey in year 2018. I have PCOD, so I had to first undergo a laparoscopic surgery, which actually resulted into very, very positive. And in April 2019, I conceived. But unfortunately, due to cervical incompetence, I lost my child in fifth month and it was very very disheartening so um, my doctor then suggested we actually tried to save the child but we unfortunately couldn't uh, we then my doctor Shweta, dr shweta goswami who's based out of noida she suggested that uh, you know the next time when i conceive we we must go for a circlage now the question was which circlage do we go for um, there is one which is vaginal there is one which is abdominal so because my abortion was my cervical incompetence as i said uh, so the abortion was inevitable uh, it was absolutely painless absolutely painless uh, so my doctor suggested uh, since it was very very silent i would need a greater support and i should go for abdominal circlage then i just didn't want to blindly go for abdominal circlage so i went ahead and started to read about it online and I found that uh, the chances of a successful pregnancy were greater in abdominal circlage as compared to vaginal circlage wherein the online research said in vaginal circlage it's 60 to 80 percent and in abdominal circlage it was 80 to 95 percent so I took my chance and I went for abdominal circlage but unfortunately in my second pregnancy also I lost the child because I went to I went to a doctor in Delhi and uh, somehow right after the surgery I had contractions and we lost the child again. So this time, so this was during the pregnancy. Uh, the risk of course was uh, worth taking but unfortunately it didn't work in our favor. So this time my doctor suggested me that I should go for an interval circlage. Interval circlage is when you're not pregnant and it happens between two, your two pregnancies. So we, we took our call and this time we contacted Dr. Ajay Agrawal. I was based in Noida. I, it was COVID time and he was not visiting Noida at all. And uh, we, we, we were suggested that we go to Chandigarh and we get the surgery done. So that's where we traveled from Noida to Chandigarh in July 2020 and I got the circlage placed. It was absolutely nothing that I felt, you know, nothing happened in my body. I was very worried if I'll be able to travel back the next day of surgery from Chandigarh to Noida. So the stress was actually more, but reality was something else. You know, it was as smooth as nothing happened to my body. And I, so as I'm saying this, I think it was less than 24 hours in which I traveled back to home. And um, it was quite easy, very, very easy. So from there, I came back to Hyderabad, which is my base location where my husband stays. And we continued with our fertility treatment in Hyderabad. But one good thing, one blessing that I had from God was uh, a doctor who was always and always available on phone for any help that we needed. And uh, by grace of God, the third time also I conceived. And uh, we were very happy. We shared the news with uh, Dr. Rajay Agarwal. He was equally happy and uh, he supported a lot all through my surgery. We called him at 10 in night, 7 in morning. He was always available. And uh, it was never that he looked up to any kind of consultation, money, appointments, nothing. You know, he was just a call away at any given point of time we needed him. All through my pregnancy, um, again, you know, there were not many complications, but uh, there were small, small complications like um, the, the sickness was a lot. Then, uh, uh, what else I could say was a complication? I think only sickness and uh, maybe uh, I had slight pain all the time in my lower abdomen. But he kept saying it is normal, normal, and normal. And we believed him. We believed in him as a doctor. And uh, he kept saying that you know nothing to worry, nothing will happen. And 
eventually it turned out to be true so i was put on prolutron injections till 34th week of my pregnancy and um, i could do all the normal activities as, as any other pregnant woman wherein if i had gone for a vaginal circular i would have been on bed rest or uh, maybe you know not allowed to move around or do any other normal activity so it was quite and quite easy and um, i completed 37 weeks in my pregnancy and was blessed with a very very cute daughter it is all because of dr ajay agarwal thank you very much sir we will never forget a human like you you are very compassionate and i have not seen a doctor like you sir thank you very much for being there for people like us and i hope uh, god gives you all the possible happiness in this world in this life or whatever you admire for sir thank you very much